I saw a uh, kind of unrelated, kind of related. This this dad, young dad, he had this baby girl, and she had a, a pacifier in her mouth, and the pacifier fell out of her mouth and onto the floor. Yeah, yeah. And it was probably on the floor for like two seconds. But what he did was he picked it up really fast. He put it in his mouth. Yeah, yeah. You got to suck on it. And then put it in the kid's mouth. Yeah. And I was like, does that, does that clean it? Is that? Well, I, I know of it because as soon as you said that, I was like, yeah, homie popped it in his mouth. You got it. That's what you do. <laughs> I would just put it in my pocket and be like, I'll wash this off later. Yeah. At this point, I, I feel like someone would pick that up. And then I'd be like, if I put this in my mouth, that's just all my germs. And like, I bet I got something, you know. I would put it in the kid's mouth and then put it (laughs) it back in your mouth. You get the COVID. (laughs) Like, yeah. Uh, I was like, would it would have been better if you know you just give it a little apparel brush? You think? I felt like that. You you really you lively up that immune system, you know. There's probably a little bit of COVID on the floor. Give him, give her a little microdose. Is that an airport too? Oh, oh, that is <laughs> everything. Dude. You got thinking, germs from all over the world. I was thinking like a street in the city, and it's like, all right, maybe you got some pee. Maybe you got some like I mean, shoes. There's no pee at the airport on the ground, I think. But, but I'm talking about this. Well, you, you go to that restroom, like right near the men's restroom, there's a little bit of a little Phoenix tinkle, if you know what I mean. Dude, shout out to people that wear their shoes inside. You guys suck. <laughs> God, <laughs> do you still have a, a war to wage against people tramping in your homely space? Absolutely. Their argument is they're going to get cat hair on their socks. I understand that. I understand. It's, it's annoying. So rude. But so rude. just put your fucking, take your shoes off. I forget what was my, because I feel like I might have worn shoes in the tucson abode i don't think so maybe i didn't but then i remember someone i think it was someone on twitter is like you're you're bringing in not just like the physical germiness of outside but all that bad mojo you know you're walking around in mojo yeah a bunch of people bad mad energy going to work Bunch of people just That's what I'm saying. Like shit. I said, as I was there, you have a little cubby, little cubby right next to your thing, and it's a place for shoes and it's a desanitization shoe igloo. It's called shig- oh. shigloo. Like they have in Japan. Do they have that? Japan has some cool stuff, man. 